This is our dog Miguel. Today he turns three years old. So for his birthday I wanted to take him to all the spots that he loves in Toronto. So this video is going to be the top five best spots to walk your dog in Toronto. You ready buddy? <laughs> Crush a bit, little bit, roll it up, take a hit, feeling lit, feeling right. This is Jeff Healy Park. This is a little park right near our place. And uh, me and Miguel walk down to it pretty much daily for our famous rock walk. And I'll show you what that's all about in a second here. But it's a, it's a nice little park and they got a little foresty area for us to walk around in as well. So let's check it out. I'm on the pursuit of happiness and I know Everything is shining on So the idea is that we can walk along the river just on the rocks and try not to get wet. Miguel's not very good at this game though. He's gonna get soaked, I'm sure. You're gonna get me soaked, Miguel. I'll be the preacher, you be the confession. I'll be the quick relief to while you're stressing. It's a thin line. So, we're in the forest now. And this is about the time that I wish I wasn't in bare feet, but that's all right. <laughs> it's all part of the nature walk here. And so as you can see this this park has you know has the river has the open park area and then it has the forest Which is pretty cool for me and Miguel. We get to have this so close to our place It's a uh, it's a pretty great little spot My life be like another spot that we come very frequently because it's right down the road from our place Humber Bay Park so there's a Humber Bay Park east and west and both of them have some really nice little rock beaches and some cool little walking trails right by the water so we come down here quite a lot just to be by the lake it's quite nice My life be like We just finished up a nice walk in Humber Bay Park East. So now we're in Humber Bay Park West. Uh, and we're about to go check out a spot that we nicknamed Doggy Heaven because every time we go there All the dogs are so happy. They're swimming in the water Hopefully we can find some happy swimming dogs this time <laughs> Come come summertime love love hold my hand Come come summertime love love take a ride with So there's a big dog park over here, and then we got the water over here, and not too many dogs. A couple came and swam, but uh, this is the, the spot we call Doggy Heaven, and it's right at the end of, right at the point of Humber Bay Park West. Beautiful spot. Definitely. 
definitely one of the biggest and one of the biggest off-leash areas for dogs as well. So right now we're at this big open sand pit where all the dogs play, uh, but also they have some forest areas that we can walk around in. Uh, so it's just it's awesome for him. He can be free of the leash for a while and uh, and just adventure around. So we'll check it out. Welcome to the good life. Welcome to the good life. The wait is over. Welcome to the good life. And after all the talk, all I gotta say is. Like so many dogs life. here everywhere. Just all You're living their best welcome. lives. It's such a happy place. <laughs> These guys up here. There's a bunch of guys back there. <laughs> Miguel's loving it. So we're back at the place relaxing now. We're back at home and uh, we only made it through three of the places today because we're exhausted. Miguel was not wanting to walk anymore and I'm pretty hungry. We both could use a bath. So we decided we'd uh, finish up the list tomorrow. And the good news is uh, Mala's mom can join us tomorrow. So Mala will be off work and we can all do the final two awesome places on the list. And I think Miguel earned a treat. Here you go, buddy. Here you go. Good boy, good boy. <laughs> See you tomorrow. All right, Miguel, you ready to go, buddy? It's gonna be a good day. <laughs> so we just got to the Scarborough Bluffs. We brought Mal along with us this time. Hi, guys. So this is a pretty cool spot. There's a nice beach which you're actually not allowed to have dogs at, but there is a part of the beach you can take your dog to, so we'll go over there and hang out for a bit. And uh, we have a really cool backdrop as well. It's like a bunch of, like a big escarpment. So it's, uh, it's pretty cool to look back on that from the beach. We'll show you. favorite spot in the summertime. We spend a lot of our time out here playing beach volleyball and it's funny because Miguel loves to watch and he he doesn't bother us on the court at all. He'll like even if he like steps his foot over we'd be like hey and then he'll just like retract and kind of just lay right on the line. It's pretty cute uh, but this is a massive beach in Toronto. It's a uh, it's a great spot. The water's freezing cold but uh, after a couple games of volleyball you might be Tempted. <laughs> Let's check it out. Lay back and be easy. Take your time, let it go, live freely and be easy. You know, palm trees, palm trees, where we sit and write. Strong drinks, strong drinks, what we're sipping like. The army, this guy just deserves to be free. He's a beach dog at heart, you know? Lay back and be easy. Take your time, let it go, live freely and be easy. Connect in the headphones. Come on, can you? Yeah. 
uh, I watch the sun travel over the sky See how long I can survive without a phone at my side And in this moment I can flash back back to my youth Imagine a black berry and fathom an apple is actual fruit Speaking of apples, I love the city I reside Well, Miguel, what'd you think of your birthday, buddy? Did you like all those spots? <laughs> We're both pretty pooched after that big day. I guess we'll try again next year, eh bud? See ya.